Coffee from Mozart Bar and Coffee Philosophy. So we are here in the cafe and we're making two coffees uh, together, both being lattes. And we're using the beautiful uh, giant bean called Nicaragua. So it's, it's a beautiful bean. Um, it's a pretty big bean. We absolutely love it. It's, it's very creamy. It's um, chocolatey at the same time and goes really well <coughs> as an espresso or as a latte. Alright, the machine that we're using is uh, from Ruggiero. Uh, beautiful machine again. Drop the temperatures down as the coffee is fresh. Uh, so, we like dropping the temperatures down. Alright, exciting. Let's begin. ready in the jug here to be steamed so uh, the way we normally do it we keep our milk ready we like our shot and milk happy together so uh, well that's the idea uh, but what we will do change of plans we'll do three coffees together this should too so we'll do a latte a flat white and a cap all three together and see how that goes um, This cup here for flat white, this one here for a cappuccino. So while this that one actually is steam, I'll just get this one ready. It's almost done. Beautiful trimmer um, and all of them. This one's done as well. So what we really want is the milk texture really well. It should look like paint and that's what we're really aiming for here. And it does, so it's a good thing. First thing I'll pour is the flat white. So you wanna, don't want to break the crema. I think that's one of the few things you really want to focus on. There we go. So that's the first one. Now the cappuccino. So I'm going to use the big jug because there's more froth. It's all just regular milk. We don't have to really worry about how we're going to split the milk and what's going to happen. Stuff like that. So even with the cap, I think it's really important not to bring the crema. There we go, number 
two. And now the third one, which is our latte. Well, all you can do with the latte, you can do an Indian, uh, a swan. A swan? What do you think? That sounds good? Thank you for watching the video.